He is Almighty, okay? So we need to kind of preparation for kind of uh, basics for the how to calibrate the auto system. Or they just uh, layers, 100 layers. No, no, could you consider for another, another 20 layers? Maybe result will, of course, maybe the result will go different. But you don't need to calculate that. If you're a boss, you say, okay, I, I need to add more data, more parameters to the system in order to get a better prediction for my business, for example. This is a, a deep learning, some kind of, uh, if you're going to study, heavy study, okay, heavy given study, but result is get worse, some case. Too much study is result get worse. This kind of system is, is very sensitive. Hmm. So most suitable uh, studying... Uh, it, could, it, mm -hmm. it, it could be, because actually some, some data could not contribute yeah, to... Yeah. To are uh, actually an insignificant impact on the on the outcome. Mm -hmm. So you you mm -hmm. could create noise into the system. Mm -hmm. Exactly, that's noise. possible. But yeah, so this is suitable noise is how to setting up is depending by the uh, computer analyst. But then uh, still, I don't feel how I it would be necessary for me as a business owner to actually know the mathematics. No, 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 not business owner. I then need to hire mathematic officer. Chief Mathematics Officer. Then, okay, owner is going to ask him, IBM Anand says that, do you believe it? I, my tuition is different, but this was I, my, my guess, but I think I, I can't believe him. Sort of things happen many times. C CIO is the same, but CMO is another responsibility. Okay, so have. very simply put, so, so it, it, from a mathematical perspective, what I could do before I add it to the model, is to say, okay, I'm going to look at the correlation between what I observe here and the outcome of what I want to forecast, right? So if I see that the, the ad additional layer, the additional element that I want to add to my prediction has a, has a, 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 has a, uh, um, has a zero correlation, why would I add it to the model? But you know how difficult that is because actually yeah, it's not yeah. just it's not just that yeah. element because this maybe if you combine this element with another element, this is, this is you can create cor uh, you can find a, a, a correlation. This is a multiple, you know. Uh, this is a yeah chart. Yeah, I know. It. And uh, I've been people say, okay, your company is like this. Mm. But my tuition, they, they just cut it up partially, you know, uh, divide this data. Mm. He got this bottom line, got the bottom line, bottom line, got the bottom line. Oh. And so we I, I adopted this bottom line is most suitable mm. price. Mm. So this you should uh, believe our survey. But originally, this, we don't know what is the true chart or not, but mm. this is they guess. But actual graph is maybe a different one. His actual graph might be, might be this, this place is, but not like this. Actual graph will not like this. But actually the graph will be calculated by the AI, not by the No, 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 don't, don't, no. Cut the human being will cut the analysis cut, put in the AI. Okay. Cut those data. No, 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 no that just, I know that. Look, this is ten, hundred thousand data, big data they have. But uh, usually, we we that data is not like this, not like that. No. Okay. They. Oh, I just, understand. This is a relative right? minimum. And they have many kind of curves. Yeah, but understand, this is not being calculated by humans. It's the AI is calculating the, no, the no, actual no. space. No, no. Big data is them give submit to AI. They just ten paths cut the data and uh, shuffle the data and uh, submit to AI 10 times. They calibrate by each by each AI, 10 times calculation. AI calculation. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. AI calculation. Yeah, yeah, so, so human being will judge how big data will chop it out for submit to AI. Otherwise, they can get, get uh, the best answer. If you want at one time 100,000 data with the computer, they just try to handle, maybe they can missing bottom line. 
Yeah, but still, that 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 doesn't explain why we need. Do to you know understand? They're missing the bottom line. Give me one more. No, why I, I, I understand the bottom. The bottom, line. The bottom I, but I I think you are trying to calculate the inner workings of AI, which which is actually something that you should this leave is, to AI. This is like this. One time, okay, they're going to put in the t- hundred thousand data into system. Right. AI system find out, calculating going to down. This is bottom and stop it. Yeah, oh, this I is no, I bottom. This is but, but so that's the reason why human being guess. No, human being guess, don't need to do No, that. no, guess to chop. I don't know which are the best person with that cutting data is the best best. But human being, hundred thousand data going to cutting two hundred thousand for each of those. One thousand, one million data, and then going to AI is going to handle all this, and AI is going to consider well, this is the bottom line, bottom line, bottom line. So what is the compare with five system calculation? Then okay, this is the bottom line. This is a way of this uh, is not, pa- hum- this not, not, not this not pa- human partial, view. partial. You know, no. this is so called partial na- something. Yes, but you don't need to do that manually as a mathematician. Actually, currently they are doing like this. Otherwise, they cannot get the bottom line. Yeah, but this is an automated process. No, no, no. This is a cutting with a human being doing that. Automation cannot do that. Okay, I tell you, you don't, you don't know what kind of graph is actually what. I know. Okay. Yeah. Nobody knows, mm. but human being cutting maybe. Okay. Yeah. Every other two hundred. So they make assumptions data. how to get a better that's prediction. Right, that's yeah, right. to find yeah. the absolute. Yeah. And human beings submit the system to AI. Ten shot. Then ten shot they and the AI going to give you the bottom line, and then bottom line, then bottom line, they going to judge. Oh, this is always right. So this is current current AI. But level. we don't need a mathemat- mathematician, uh, chief mathematician officer for that. Why? This is something that uh, the why okay AI you, can do okay if you mean if, if you mean IBM or Google analyst are going to tell you the data. Oh, this is a most suitable information you should get and he should believe it okay you if you're going to doubt it how are you going to handle it well basically how you're going to handle it is that okay i believe that the ai is not capable of predicting the future because the situations that i'm dealing with at the moment are either unique or the data that I have at my disposal is not sufficient to actually predict the future efficiently. Therefore, I need to adjust the outcome for what I know, what the, the AI doesn't know. But the, the only way, the only thing that I need to consider there is that I need to consider how much data do I have, what's the quality of the data, um, what is the breadth and depth of the data, but I don't need to consider the inner workings of the AI itself. As, same, a, as same, a manager... Okay. What I'm talking about same. And uh, they're going to chopping out data for using AI. Mm. And uh, this approach, I tell you, okay, this is something wrong. Or maybe we are missing some important information, submit for AI. Or yeah. some just chopping this uh, cycle is something wrong. That result is different. Of course, they are going to different way, the result different. Mm. So we need to consider how they are going to calculate it. Otherwise, we don't know how, how we are going to data shopping out. I still don't think that that is exactly what is necessary for us to consider. And, okay, how to going to feed data to the computer? Well, that's, uh, that's something that we need to consider. And what Definitely. kind of parameters are we going to submit for the uh, make Parameters? Data? will only influence the speed at which it learns, not the actual and, uh, output and of the And how, how they are going to consider for the mathematical equation, what kind of important they are going to submit for, for brain? Or maybe missing some brain or missing some uh, important issue for some specific industry? Okay, do, uh, okay you're just thinking about uh, machine learning is not the same as human being. Oh. Neuron is limited. Like uh, one trillion neuron, do no, they don't have. So not perfect, right? And oh. human being is not perfect. But machine is more not perfect. No, I think actually, right? it's right? not. It, I think what I just described about right? the, uh, the ERP connected with AI, right? it's 
so incredibly complicated. Yeah. I don't think AI will be able to solve it because right. the number uh, of right. variables is and too also big. And also, data memorize every kind of dictionary, mm. a million million computer data and uh, X-ray pictures, everything else. But that is a quite limited play. E exactly. Yeah. So we can that that we, we can, can we can lots of way of uh, adjusting the result. Right. But um, we will never never be able to yeah, generate an AI exactly. that will effectively forecast mm, yeah, the entire yeah. economic outcome for uh, the United States yeah, over the next yeah. five years. Cancer detection is uh, very high accurate information mm. they can provide us. But this yep. is a simple case. Yeah. But business case is not simple. No. More sophisticated. Just even if one small shop, what is the best uh, solution? Right. It's very difficult. But it I is know. the holy grail. I tell you, okay. One more, more big issue. One small shop is not only customer. You yourself have a lot of influence for the system. You yourself, your character, mm. your mindset, your emotional movement, this very big impact for his, his company sales. Kind of information with this system, otherwise we cannot get accurate information, right? Mm. Sort of things we should be considered. And uh, also, uh, maybe I won't tell you, okay? Uh, maybe I think we had better put in your character. Right. Five characters. We should. You should be put in. Well, but uh, how is this? How they actually, is this actually going to work? So basically, the computer. Will okay, kind of system. Will suggest uh, me okay, kind of customer never buy from you. Hmm. Mm. So if I were, if I were, if I was the owner of the 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 convenience store uh, yeah, downstairs, right? Then no, the, the, just the, this convenience store downstairs. And uh, I would come in on Monday morning and I would look at, okay, so what does the system uh, forecast me to buy? So, so what, what sales do they forecast? And then I say, okay, this, this, okay, well, this I don't need or this I will make it a bit higher because I know that, for example, uh, there will be a, a, like a, a big uh, event in this, in this area or the... Um, the Hanami uh, the, is, is coming this week, so even though it, it, it asked me to order so much beer, but I think I will order a little bit more, that's how, of course, it will work. People will not completely say, okay, well, completely hands off. But, yeah, so if, as long as you rec recognize the limitations of the predictions, even though, yeah, even though you don't know, know everything, but if you don't know better in the system, then why wouldn't you trust the system? So and everything can help, right? So it's just like, just like. Uh, okay, like uh, Amazon Go. Yeah. Uh, no people working, right? Mm -hmm. This is uh, not AI. No. This is automation, right? Yeah. So AI is okay. Uh, they're going to employ the attitude. They're going to change. Every customer comes to the store. It's kind of irrational like muscle. And every then going out, thank you very much. And also they try to consider for light and more bright or just uh, how spotlight is going more, more, more light, how it's going to change customer reaction and sort of things, several uh, parameters we can get, can add on the, how the result is uh, customer How is that with uh, facial recognition actually? Of course, facial recognition, oh, how about 100% accuracy now. Right, otherwise they wouldn't be able to, to, to lock smartphones down, mm, for yeah, example. Yeah, yeah. But, um... And facial recognition, uh, my recommendation is more than that. This salesperson or just the cashiers, they're going to smile, or they're going to hire the beautiful lady, mm. or younger person, mm. and younger person going to hourly charge going higher, and older person cheaper. Just try several cases, which one is you can get more profit. Uh, I mean, but this is depend depend on the uh, different by district by district, okay? But it's a little bit dangerous, don't you think? Like for yeah, yeah, dangerous. But uh, this is data. So let's let's say that I have a, that I live in China. I'm going to a shop where I can buy goods based on my facial recognition. The, what I need to do is I go to Facebook. I find somebody who lives in that area, and see who's shopping there. Then I just download a picture, 3D printed, 
uh, as a mask and I put the mask on, walk into the store and I can shop for free. Well, then, <laughs> well <laughs> I, how did you can break the system? With facial recognition, people, they, they, ha they have a profile on Facebook to show. So actually, if I can uh, go on Facebook and just download a picture of that person who, who shops there, make a 3D... But you cannot do that. Why not? No, the other people, right? Yeah. No, you can do it. Why not? No, no, cannot. This is a... If this person... This is, no, no, this is personal information. Hello. If I go on your Facebook page, I see pictures of you, right? Yeah. So if you use your face to pay downstairs, I download your picture from Facebook and I 3D print it, make a mask, oh, I walk in the, in the shop. Mm. There you go. <laughs> I, can buy, I can shop for free. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not capable, perfect. Is it capable? I, I think it will be capable. I mean, masks, we can make a lot. I don't know. It's probably too expensive to make. Oh, it, I tell you, facial recognition system is already in China more than 10 years ago. Yeah, well, uh, now so it's currently it's very precise. And they just tried to, uh, they told me at that time 10 years ago, uh, very strict recognition. It is very difficult to accept everybody. Loose recognition, okay, everybody can get inside, hmm. but this loose recognition is risky. Ru so what is loose recognition? Yeah, just, okay, how to judge your eye eyesight, uh -huh. and uh, they're going to, who you are, it's uh, many points, they can recognize who you are. Hmm. No, I don't. Who you are. So currently, they have precise recognition. Like uh, current system, they cannot accept uh, the picture. I believe. Mm, no picture, but but the mask. No, they can. Otherwise, they can utilize facial recognition. They can make a ma make a mask and copy. Mm. Yeah, they, I, I don't think it. Or for example, okay, this is I you you are putting mask, or then if I can recognize you put in mask. This is a computer cannot recognize you mm. put in mask. But many cases even just uh, make a copy. 3D printing, just prepare your mask, but the computer will recognize you are, you are not you. How? Oh. But okay, this is simple. If I can recognize, I think you're not your true you, right. I can recognize. And this case is the computer is all the same level. Right. So, but actually, the risk is much higher because um, at that point, you only have one, one point of uh, check, just the person's face, not like a a unique code or something. Okay, like this hmm. case maybe uh, if so, hmm. you are right. If so, they in your future they are going to ask you, could you pronounce your name? Hmm. Yeah, uh, or could you, could or you, you have maybe your eye, your no, your no, no. Pupils. I'm talking about you. you are tell me your birthday, hmm. and uh, in computer, as many people uh, make a steal my friends' uh, mail address, and they send me the information. You can get a good deal. And then we make a writing letter. Then, then I ask him, "Oh, Peter, when your birthday?" Hmm. Then usually he <laughs> cannot answer me. Hmm. Or oh, this is, uh, you know, just uh, he tried to steal my money. Iris scan maybe. Iris scan is very difficult to. Uh, so this case is okay. maybe the current system they can recognize who you are. Hmm. They are going to ask you the your birthday date. Maybe usually they and you will pick you, you can answer your birthday. And the machine is recognize who you are, registered, they're going to ask you birthday. Mm. Well, okay, so there, there, there is a possibility of multiple check, but I just I was just surprised. You were right, you were right. I think uh, 3D technology make In a China, that yeah, they just yeah. only use that as a... Yeah, they, they can still. But China is a uh, facial recognition, is heavy history. Rather than Japan and US. Mm, yeah. Because they are population. But they don't, they don't worry so much about privacy. <laughs> no, no, no. They have a huge population. Mm. So their requirement is how to recognize their employees and not the employees. They try to separate all those kind of, you know, uh, wrong persons, many wrong persons, mm. wrong in, in do, wrongdoing people a lot. So they try to the most urgently to develop the system.
I didn't know that. I, 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 at that time, Tendiado are these two companies. Yeah. And at, even though that time, they have very active information they were collecting. Yeah. 